Good afternoon. Thank you, members. Thank you, mods. Thank you for gathering here today, this afternoon. My fellow cart lifers, as we speak to an issue that has become of utmost importance to the community, as we choose a team to lead us, a leader to represent us, to rally behind, it's a decision that I, as we all must, have given deep consideration. Much vetting and thorough investigation has been done with core leaders from our community. I wanna thank Tabor on the data team, and again, the mods, other members of this community who have helped mine the information that we need to make a thorough and informed decision. Looking at the data, looking at the issues that matter the most to our community. When this rally was announced, early polling and tracking seemed to indicate that one thing was clear that there has been a great call for change, a rally for change. But as we know, what we know from the past is it's not over until every vote is counted and every vote must be counted. We have certainly seen a movement unlike anything we've seen before in this community, a call for change, but lest we give in to group think, understand this, 2020, while it started off with the gift of the 2020 glider, boding great hope and aspiration for a new year. It's been a year of difficulty, upheaval, disease, the pandemic, trauma, great economic difficulty, loss, a year of chaos. The last thing we need right now is further disruption to the sense of normalcy that we've come to so miss and cherish from our lives as players. And the hard, hardworking players out there are longing for a sense of calm and familiarity, not a radical diversion from the norm, to come together around the institutions that have comforted us, have been central to the strength of our community. And looking for a leader that has carried us through from the beginning, since our earliest days with the Nintendo Entertainment System. So I'm here today to announce my endorsement for Team Mario. I know I speak for millions when I say the Team Mario is the clear choice to restore stability, not just to the, the ruby and the coin economy that has seen so many players struggling to make ends meet in their game, to be able to pick up a high-end ticket in their daily selects without their shop being shut down, or to pull for a top-shelf character they, they so need or that they just want. But restoring a stability that's crucial to the very soul and spirit of us all as players. We have a great rival in Team Luigi, and I, I commend them for their campaign and those who have championed them. It'll be a tough, good fight. But they too have captured the hearts and minds of the community. And, and those who vote Luigi, they're not indecent people. They're good, hardworking players just like us. They're not people looking up to just pick up a quick reward or level up, point cap ticket. We must come together with dignity and respect once this is all over, no matter who is chosen, to create a better game for all. 
So I encourage you to exercise your right and your freedom to vote. Vote with your conscience. Race a good, hard, clean race. And send feedback for standard challenges 3-1 to 3-5. Standard challenges 4-1 to 4-5. Actual expert challenges fixing tier matching and the friend list and adding Kamek to the game. Thank you. I'll not be taking any further questions at this time. Oh, and it's probably fine for you to just pick whichever one you want. I, Team Luigi is probably going to win, and I might even still pick Team Luigi. It doesn't really matter that much. Uh, they're not going to give major rewards to half the players and let half the other players lose out. It's probably fine. So just pick whoever you want. We'll see what happens. But yeah, no. Team Mario.